Hi everyone, I'm so excited! I went to an Amazon return store. So I've never been to one before. I wasn't sure what to expect. So in this store, depending on which day you go, is going to be how much it cost. So today was $1 day. So everything was a dollar. <laughs> That's pretty much how it worked. And then apparently they close tomorrow and they kind of clean and reset the place and then they open back up on Friday at $10. And then after that, the price goes down. So it's like 10, 7, 5, 3, 2, and then 1. And then they close again and then, you know, it starts all over again. So apparently they've been open for a couple months. I had no idea until just yesterday. Um, there is no shopping carts. So luckily I got the heads up to take like a bag. So we actually have like a beach wagon thing. So I took that and then I thought like I was gonna be the only one there with it. But no, there was a bunch of people with their wagons and like trash bags and stuff. So it was wild. It was so much fun. Um, my mom and I probably spent an hour in there. I was so proud of her that she was able to like stand and walk for that time, you know, um, but let me show you guys what I got. So this box has this right here. So it is a wrapping paper kit to go ahead and organize, which I thought was fantastic. So it has space for your paper. And then this little like cardboard piece right here, it like Velcros to the side. And then you could put your ribbon up here. And then there was pockets on the side. So um, right here that shows to put like... Um, gift bags so I put our labels in there like I already filled one up with Sunny because I was just so excited to put it together and to use it so instead um, we put like gift tags that I had got on clearance um, I think in like January and then up here there's another pocket which I was thinking about buying tape and having it and putting it in there so that way I know where it is for when Christmas comes around to go ahead and just get started. So um, right here they show gift cards. So yeah, I got two of these. So um, we can definitely fill this one up because I have a whole closet full of wrapping paper. Um, I actually wanted to get like four of them, but I only found two. So there's that. And then um, my mom went crazy on these. So these say that they are diamond art right there so i think she got one that was open let me see if i can find it oh see so this one was open so we just kind of took a peek and um they do have signs like that says don't open anything but there's tons of stuff open and empty boxes so you just gotta make sure that all the pieces were in there so it's the christmas tree and then here are the drill bits so i hope that they're all in here and then here is the kit that you need, but we have tons of those. Here's the base. And then here is the little ornament that hangs in the center. So if you've been following me for a while, I did do some of these that were sent to me um, by companies to, you know, use and review. So we were really excited or she was really excited to find these. And then I was like, I just kind of want them just for the little rhinestones, you know, so look at how gorgeous that clear is right there so pretty so yeah she got um i think like four of those maybe let me see oh no there's more in the bag um yeah she got quite a bit of those so um i don't know i was wondering like for diamond art stuff like this would you guys one one in a giveaway where you put it together or would you want one where you know it would probably most likely be my mom um that would complete one and then like I can seal it and then have that be a giveaway prize so let me know down in the comments would you want to do your own kit or would you want one completed and just already have to go so let me know in the comments what you guys would like and then I was so bummed. I ruined this and I'm so sad. I was so excited to find this for a dollar. I thought it was so cool. It's a baseball card album. 
my nephews are playing baseball right now so i was thinking how cool would this be to use as a photo album and i just have to cover the part that says baseball album but when i was taking everything out of the wagon so the wagon has like a pole in the middle and you're supposed to lay like this cardboard flap thing down but because i just wanted to like rush off to the store i didn't think i needed it i didn't lay it down and then i ended up smashing the book so you can see like right here is a little square of where that little pole is from the wagon so i ruined this and i'm so sad so just the weight of everything just smushed this because this was on the bottom and i'm so sad that was a hundred percent my fault and i'm so sad about it because like i said i wanted to use this for a photo album but it does come with some page protectors or card sleeve protectors which y'all know that we use these for um pocket letters so i mean for a buck i have a bunch of these pocket letters and then i have this album but like i said i messed it up i don't know i'm thinking maybe i could just go ahead and put like a 12 by 12 back here and maybe kind of hide the indent i don't know we'll see but yeah i ruined that and i'm super bummed about it so that was my fault um let me move this stuff so I found this little black bear. I thought it's so cute. It is just foam roses. And the ribbon says just for you. I thought that was so stinking cute. So um, this one is missing like a little flower right here. But other than that, it looks pretty well. Oh, maybe there should have been one right here. Um, yeah, there probably was one there. But I mean, it looked pretty dang good. And then for a dollar, I was like, yep, I am taking that little guy home so they had this black one a pink one a gray one and like a blue one but i only got the black one because i don't know that's just more me and my style so i thought that was really cute i remember seeing these before for like 30 bucks or something you know like something crazy so let's see i got these for a dollar which i thought were really cool you could just add some little like stickers add some like little paint and stuff and you know use this as like a center piece of a little chunky charm i'm probably not going to use all of these but i might give some of those away in like some happy mail stuff i found these paint brushes that looked really nice this looked like a pack that used to be like at michael's i think and it actually does have like the number of the brush on the handle so yeah i thought those were really nice so for a dollar figured why not and i found these i was so excited look at these shamrocks so there are 36 pieces of shamrock ornaments which i could use for next year for a buck i think that's a good deal it looks like there's maybe four different patterns in here let me see so there's that one. Oh yeah and then that one. Oh and then this one right here so there's three and then there's number four number five and pattern number six those are really awesome so a dollar i want to say i got two of these but i'm not sure if they're the same patterns or not and then this stuff changes so it's never guaranteed what's going to be there or what they're going to have because like i said it's just amazon returns so um yeah let's see oh my mom found these so these are like little nail art stuff that she had got for me so they look to be like halloween but then this one looks like cats and seashells and um that looks like a spider but then like maybe like a little love heart so i thought that was really cool so a dollar for that one i got these because i was like what are these and over here it said um like tea or coffee so i need to open this up and see i thought like maybe they were like little um like ziploc baggies possibly so i figured like can i use these maybe in like junk journals i don't know so let's see what do these look like they had a quite a few of these actually but um like i said i only got the one because it says it's 300 and i'm like oh yeah i do not need that many oh i see so it is just a little tea bag so you fill it up yourself right there with your little tea and then you just 
close it on up. You just pull the string and there you go. You have your little tea bag. That is cool. I think I can use this for junk journals, right? So 300 disposable tea bags. That is a whole lot of tea bags. But yeah, I thought that was really cool. I can probably even put like um little bead stuff in here and use this for like vintage maybe and like put some stamps or stickers on there. That might be cute. So got those. Oh my gosh, this was like the prime like jewel of my eye from this whole trip, okay? I buy these from Amazon for like $15, $16. I bought some at Valentine's Day and I bought some at Christmas, but I didn't buy these. So these were a dollar, you guys. And I'm gonna have so much of this like twine stuff now because there's some with um, these as well. But look, there are some snowflakes, some blue, some silver, some dark blue. Yes, a dollar. Super stoked about that. And they had a ton of these. A lot of them were open. So I think I got one that was closed. So, oh, this is not what I thought it was. I thought this was paint. This is powder. Okay, I don't know what this is. This is, is this sand art? I thought this was puffy paint and I should have looked at this better. When I saw it like this, I, and even just like um, thrown in like these little buckets, I thought it was puffy paint. I think this is sand. I think this is sand art. Oh my God, this is not what I thought it was. I think I only paid a dollar. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what this is. Okay, I'm gonna have to open that and play with that. I think it might be like sand art stuff. Um, let's see. I found some Halloween cards and it said Hallmark right here. I'm not sure how many you get. Maybe like a dozen of those. I found this. Look, you guys, I found a die. Can you believe that? Yes, I found a die set for a dollar. Oh, it's a layering piece. Does it go this way? It does. Look, it's a layering piece. Ooh, is this supposed to be like a sunflower maybe? I don't know. That's pretty cool. So I got to play with that. A dollar for that. Super stoked about that. I also found some Valentine's Day stickers. So I don't know how many are in there, but super excited about that. I found some little um, thank you, like a little roll of thank you. So, um, for my swaps, I sent a thank you card out and a little gift to everybody. So, I was thinking that I could use this. Oh, 500 pieces. So, I figured I could use this for my next swap that I have coming up. Um, there was this that I don't know what it is. My mom found it and was like, I don't know, I thought you needed it. So, <laughs> I have no idea what it is. But, yeah, I bought it for a dollar. It kind of looks like cherry blossoms, but it's like fabric and it's actually kind of large. So, I don't know. I'm going to have to figure out what that is. Um, let's see. Oh, my mom found these. So, they're thermometer covers. So, there's a hundred covers in here. I thought that was really nice. So we have that. Um, what is this? I don't know what it is. So my mom has found this and she knows that I love Nightmare Before Christmas. So what is this? Oh, a tree skirt. It's a tree skirt. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, that's really, really pretty. Okay, that's an awesome find. Good job, mom. And uh, let's see, I had found some little Christmas tags right here. And it has the like little twine to it. Um, it doesn't say how many there are. And then, you know how we do the diamond art stuff. So I had found this little kit that I thought was cute for a dollar. So, oh, I don't know what that's for. But there's a little tray. There's some little bags. There's some like little like. Um, finger things here like a little like spatula thing let's see some tags little clippies so yeah there's like a whole little kit I don't know what this is for it just looks like a C cable I don't know so I don't know what this was meant for that it would have a cable in it but yeah for a book I thought that was cool so 
And we do that. And like I said, we just bought all of those other diamond art ones. Oh, no. This one broke open. So here is um, the other shamrocks right here. So this looks to be exactly like the other one that I had bought. But um, the bag opened up. Yeah, so all the rest are down in here. Okay, let me put this away and then I'll show you what I got in the next um, bag. And let's see, I have got these. So these say that they are iPhone chargers. Now, I don't have them, but my brother does. So I figured, why not for a buck? And then my mom had found these N95 masks. So yeah i mean why not for a dollar for 60 of them that's really good right so have those and then um you guys know i like decorating my hotel room so i figured if we ever get out to universal studios that i could use this for decorations it's harry potter stuff this one i honestly wanted just for like the pretty little butterfly appliques back here but this ribbon is gorgeous and there is a little happy birthday right there um, my mom got a couple of books. There should be more down in here. This is a table runner. There was um, some that were open, so I knew what it was. So I just got the closed one. Here's another pack of beads that were like in a Christmas theme. These are like little spikes. But if you see like right here, you can like put a string or something through the base. So then like make it for like jewelry. But I'll probably just use them as like little spikes. So there's supposedly 360 pieces in there. And um, these are like leaves that light up. So there was three to the pack. This is just for like cleaning. So you put your soap in here and then attach the different heads. They had a ton of these, like a whole box full. I only got one of those. I probably should have gotten more um, and used one for like the bathroom and one for like the kitchen. Oh, look, I got another one of those. I'm going to give that um, to my brother's girlfriend let's see oh my gosh i always sing the hippopotamus song like just random times at christmas just all the times so when i saw this i was like oh my god i need that in my life so i got my little hippopotamus shirt and then it was like in my size which was amazing um my mom found some disposable masks I found these little like nail decals. Oh, here's another one of those table runners in Nightmare Before Christmas. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut them apart. So like, you know, Dollar Tree sold blank ornaments. I still have some. So I'm going to trace out the ornament and then glue these on to the ornament. So that's my plan. So I got, um, I think two or three of these because I wanted to do that. These are little like table covers. It's so cute. So, like, if we do where the kids decorate their own cookies or, like, at Easter, they, you know, dye their eggs. When you lay it out on the table, this is kind of like a shower cap for the table. So, you're going to put this on the table and then um, if they make a mess on there, no big deal. And then you just pop off this, like, table cover and, like, keep all the trash inside and then just throw the whole thing away. So, I thought that was pretty awesome. There's supposedly 100 pieces in here. So, that's going to last us for quite some time. I found some little Nomi homies. I found this Hello Kitty little flag, which I just thought she was really pretty. So probably going to use her for like wall decor. She's just really cute for Christmas. Um, I don't have an iPad, but I'm like, okay, just because I found this, now I need to buy me an iPad. So <laughs> my mom thought I was absolutely crazy. But look, it's Disney. Like Tigger, Snow White, you know, Nemo, um, Stitch is my favorite. So I'm like, yeah, I totally needed that. And um, this is just a Grinch tree skirt. And then... This was another one exactly the same. Again, I'm going to cut out their little faces for like ornaments. And then there's this Grinch that I can use the same way. But I only found one of these. But I figured, you know, to make little ornaments. Um, this one I thought was absolutely beautiful. So it's just little sunflowers. It's just like a little flag for outside. So I thought that was beautiful. Here's my mom's other little book right here oh, i found this little um happy birthday little mickey so it's like a little cake topper so i thought that was really pretty 
um let's see i found this one welcome foolish mortals so if you guys know disney uh, foolish mortals is haunted mansion so i got that there were these i hope they're not broken so they are just like acrylic um like pens holders you could put like your lipstick stuff in there you know type of a thing so there's two of those so you know two for a dollar that's super good then they had these like little like um what is this like needlework crochet little bells but they're like stiff so i was thinking i could put some ribbon around here and then put like a little like holly leaf or something to it so i thought those were really pretty to go ahead and use and decorate and then I got this little sign that I'm going to send to a crafty friend. Uh, let me see. Here's another bag of beads. Um, this is just a little, um, like, top little jacket thing, you know, like, that's, like, lacy. But I thought it was really pretty for a dollar. I could cut this up or I could wear it, although this is not my color. Like, I prefer dark clothes. So, I was thinking about possibly, like, using it just for crafting. I found some little Snoopy Thanksgiving cards. And that's it. That was everything from my first time going to an Amazon return store. I loved it. Look at all this like crafty, useful stuff that I got. I am hooked. Like this is going to be so much fun. I cannot wait to go back. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day and we'll see you later. Bye guys.